online series for Limerick Jazz Festival 2020. Tonight we feature some of the great musicians that have been on the scene for many years. Dr. Lindley Hamilton, flugelhorn, composer, arranger, session musician. Kean Boylan, composer, arranger, session musician. Derek Doc O'Connor, session musician, incredible saxophone player. Dave Redmond on bass, another great session player and jazz aficionado and on drums, Marty McCloskey. Really cool quintet and they're gonna feature four tunes from Lily's last album for the record. So sit back and enjoy this great performance. Thank you. I'm Kim Boyle from Dublin on piano. I'm Derek O'Connor on saxophone. I'm David Redmond on bass. I'm Marty McCluskey on drums. And I'm Lily Hamilton. It's my band. I really need to get these guys insured. That's how good they are. This is the first time we've played together. In fact, we've even met together uh, in five months because of lockdown. And we're so grateful to John Daly uh, and Limerick Jazz Festival for inviting us a special commission uh, to play this music for you tonight. Uh, it's been a treat for us. Uh, the band loves each other. We've actually just released an album in March and we did an Irish tour. And um, it's called For The Record. And we decided for this particular uh, jazz festival premiere event to play four original tracks that we recorded in that album. And it's the first time they've been videoed and played live outside the record. So uh, thank you very much again. John Daly, for those of you who don't know, is one of those men who has really almost single-handedly over the years put this festival on, uh, runs jazz events, teaching uh, throughout the year, has a fantastic team assembled uh, with him. And is just one of those free spirits that makes the music happen because he puts everybody else first. And that kind of love and affection is the kind of thing that draws people like us to put the boat out a wee bit special and, and, and make this event happen. So enjoy. Uh, we've got a 35 minute show for you today, recorded in Camden, uh, recording studios in Dublin, and have a fantastic festival.
That was Mo Hip, uh, written by Kane Boylan. Uh, the next track up is Split. Uh, it's one of those kind of lively post bop tunes that, again, written specifically for this project by Kane and myself. So fasten up your seatbelts.
that was split. We're going to go straight into yet another original. The whole set today really specifically geared towards the uh, incredible opportunities that we had with the record, for the record, with Adam Nussbaum and Mark Egan. But some spectacular musicians here uh, replacing them. Marty McCluskey on drums, Dave Redmond on double bass. This is a belter. It's called Right Angle.
Once again, thanks very much to Limerick Jazz Festival for this really special commission. Uh, this is my favourite band I've probably ever had. And uh, we had a very successful record uh, earlier in the year for the record. And I'm delighted to say that all the material we've played tonight have been originals from that record. Starting off with Bo Hip, composition of Kane's, Split, composition of uh, Kane and myself, and Right Angle again, Kane right up the middle of that. The musicians, once again, Marty McCluskey on drums from Northern Ireland, Dave Redmond, double bass uh, from Dublin, Kane Boylan, uh, producer, keyboard player on the record, uh, from Dublin on piano and Doc O'Connor on tenor saxophone. It's been fantastic. Uh, we're going to close with a track that means an awful lot to us. Uh, it got an awful lot of radio play in America this year where we had 10 weeks in the American Airplay charts. It's called Holly's Moment and it's dedicated to Doc's two-year-old uh, Holly, Holly O'Connor. Uh, and also the album was dedicated to Doc's sister Maureen who passed away uh, during the whole project. So... Uh, thank you so much for supporting us and keep supporting live jazz. Limerick is where it's at. This is Holly's moment.
Finally, I'd like to thank all the musicians who took part in the online series. Without your originality, your initiative and your genuine support for an incredible art form, this would not have been possible. We all had to think outside the box this year, I think, and we are delighted that we were able to support you in some way. So on behalf of Limerick Jazz, we thank you sincerely. Have a great week and enjoy the rest of the festival. Lastly, I would like to thank an incredible committee. Without them, this festival would not happen. And I want to name these people because they deserve to be named. Ed Hanson, Jerry Kirby, Deirdre Wilson, Rory Keane, Fiona O'Connell. Our website has been managed by Joe O'Brien, our graphics by Birgit Burhen, and Giuseppe Tara, who does all the emails. So thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. It has been a pleasure to work with you, and I hope we can do this many years to come.